Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. This is going to be episode 52. So last episode I said it was going to be 53 or 4 or something. I was completely wrong. I checked the order and I was wrong. So uh, don't judge me, okay? I forgot. A, a general mess up on my part. Let me see. Let's go right here. We're not done with this yet, but we're about to be. So I have this whole plan that I got thought up. Thought up, okay? This is going to be awesome. I hope. I hope you guys like it too. Um, I'm actually going to surround this area in a waterfall. And, and you'll see exactly what what it's going to look like here in a second. Um, let's make our way up here and kind of remove these flowers. I think I'm just going to throw these flowers away. Because I'm going to be honest. Mums are ugly. Mums are ugly flowers. And I think I'm the only one in saying that. Because everybody else tends to like them. But I think mums are the, the grossest looking flowers I've ever seen. <laughs> Let me get rid of them real quick then. Alright, one by one. We're actually going to go sell these. And hopefully Nook gives us a decent price for the mums. I don't think he will though, because he's a piece of crap and ends up paying you like barely anything for anything. Um, but after we get done with this, because I do not think it's going to take forever. I think I'm going to go straight to the beaches and see if we can... can if we could find... Um, what's his name? Uh, Gulliver. I, I wish you could put a bridge over this. This would be so cool with a bridge. If you could, but... I think it's too far apart in the first place. So... My pockets are full. Let's bury that again. So, maybe I'll come back and move those ones alone. Alright. Cool with me, though. We'll eventually get this going. Um, I'll have to move those eventually as well. I can't wait to coach his house moves. That'll be tomorrow. So the episode after this one will showcase that that it'll be like, hey, yo, look, coach's house has moved and this is done and it looks nice. That I know what I'm going to say. It's like basically a thought process that I'll have anyway. Of course, what exactly are you offering? I'm selling all these useless mums and actually these pansies because I have them in my inventory. All right. There you go. And look at all the fine things you brought in today. 20 bells, 480, still not worth anything. Which is okay though, at least we got something. We want that briefcase too eventually. I think that'll look cool somewhere. Maybe beside one of the chairs in the rec center? I don't know. You know, because people are doing business there. Maybe, I don't know. Could be anything. But, now that we got that done, let's get this waterscape thing going. Bam. Now let's get started on this area. Uh, so I know that you can't put it right at the edge. I think you can only put it like Right there. I Don't know if you could put it in the corner either Okay, hold on. Let's cover this up real quick bam. I don't think you could put it in the corner. No, what the heck? Um, let's try this again Let's remove this actually Nope so, this is how it's going to be, okay? Um, so far, it looks like as if I'm going to have to skip the end parts and kind of just put it at the corners, which is okay. So, we're going to have it like this, these bad boys going straight down. We're going to keep going down with this one. And it's going to be on both sides. I'm going to have the waterfall going on both sides, kind of showcase it off a bit see bam bam let's do the edges first or the very end first we'll have the gates covering this side up and then we'll have an entrance on a different side so we can have that going I don't even know if I'm gonna keep this idea this idea might be scrapped but it's something I was thinking of doing so might as well keep going with the idea right um, it's gonna be super loud in this area though I just noticed waterfalls are loud so Alright, that's not what I meant to do, but that's okay. I was going to remove that path anyway. Bam, so now we got water streamline. And then, that's that's a bad. I can't break that one if that one's gone. There we go. So far, I think this is going to look okay. I think. I'm hoping. We'll see. Okay, this is already going bad, though. It's going to keep happening, I guarantee. I'm going to move back, and I'm going to end up refixing what I did before. I'm also going to do a line of water down there 
to kind of make it look like a thing. And then I'll make a waterfall in the, or in uh, a river leading to the other side in the middle, kind of, so I could put a bridge. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. Now that... Nope. One more. There we go. So now that that's done, let's get a good look at it real quick. Kind of get a feel of what's going on. Bam. Look at that. No. What the heck? How did that even happen? Life. Life is like this. Ugh. Now I'm going to have to go back and break it apart. So I know how hard this is going to be now. <laughs> Maybe I should have worked on the bottom one first. Bam. So we got that going on. We're going to do this too. And I'll show you here in a second. Ah. Okay, hold on. Let's do this real quick. Bam. Let's just break it apart. Try our best. And hopefully we don't make any more. But if we do, then we'll just keep fixing. Because this game is a mess and it doesn't like doing anything that you want it to do. Maybe I'll start with the bottom on the other side then. Because if it keeps building up like that, that's going to be a huge problemo. But... This, this also is like kind of a thought process that I had. Like, if I work on this, this will be my first water project that I really dwell into for waterfalls. I mean, we kind of got into it before, but not necessarily, you know? Let's kind of actually plug that and make it a corner piece. Yeah, but th we didn't really necessarily get into it. So this is a good kind of peek into what waterfalls can actually do. I see a lot of people do this kind of thing at the front of their entrance, but I don't I don't think that's something I would ever do. I think having it far off in the back as a scenic route right next to the Zen is like perfect. I might even have like a little river going through the Zen. So we'll see what I do in that case. That is for a later episode when I actually redecorate the Zen garden, which probably won't be this episode. I'll probably get to that one eventually. Um, this episode probably won't be on the same day as the other one. But the Zen Garden might be on the same day as this one? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I guess you'll see in the future, right? <laughs> I guess I'll see in the future. I don't know. Plans come up. Nope. That's not what I meant to do. There we go. There we go. There we go. Alright. So let's see. Is this almost matched up? I think that's fine right now. Um, let's get... Nope. That is not at all what I was trying to do. I wonder if you could actually fish from this waterfall zone. Alright. Nope. I keep, I keep forgetting where I where this even goes. So we'll start... Nope. Start from the corner. I don't know. Would the corner look better? Just like, just one side of it like this? Or does that side look better? I don't know. This side kind of looks more artificial, which kind of gives it that feel like, oh, they decorated this themselves. That side looks more natural, but also clunky. So I actually don't know what I plan to do with this. Eventually, we'll figure it out, but as for right now, we'll just keep working on this bad boy. Let's see how this ends up looking. Now that it's actually starting to look a lot bigger, it's starting to look a bit nice I don't think you could do corner pieces like that so that'll be alright that'll kind of show off that that's the end one and maybe we'll put little street lights at the end of that but let's kind of curve off this corner here a bit bam bam okay so what I wanted to do was right in the middle so which is right here we'll kind of do like a little bridge bam and then we'll have to do it by three. So we'll go on this side. And then we'll jump across. And then we'll do one more right here. And then we'll make a little bridge so then it looks like a little fancy, you know. We got a bridge coming in between. I'm hoping it looks fancy. We'll see. <laughs> Eventually we'll see, at least. So now let's curve off this corner piece on this side too. Just so it doesn't look so blocky. Bam. Bam. Okay. So now that we're going to get like a little bridge in the middle. Um, I like the waterfall 
on the right side. I like it on the right side for the reason that it looks natural. I don't know. We're gonna do it on like it is on the right side though. So, let's start on this side because then we'll get trapped by the, the giant cliff. We might even remove some of that cliff. Trying to give it that realistic look. Or, you know what I just thought of? I mean, we have a little lake up there, right? I'll show you here in a second. Hold on. Let me finish off this one. And then we'll see what we got in terms of that. That way it'll look more realistic and it'll connect to the other river. And then it'll be like, oh, that makes sense, you know? And maybe it will look dumb. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Bam. 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 Cool. Now that we got that, let's make a climb up here. We're probably going to have to chop down that tree. And then, let's see. Nope, that's not what I meant. Um, let's get our axe real quick. We don't have our axe in our inventory, so we'll have to pull it out from here. Alright. Chop down these two trees that are kind of in the way. And that one, too, I suppose. Alright. I kind of expected that, but it's okay. It will prevail. <laughs> we'll have to move some of this, these flowers as well. Which... Kind of... Oh my god, another one? Nope. Not in time. Normally I do it in time, but we'll try it next time. This will give me time to prepare, like, emptying out my inventory. Let me see. I just have one mum. Maybe I'll put it... Right here. Bam. Uh, that did not go where I wanted to, but we'll fix it eventually. Okay. Back up to the top. This uh, little piece of strip actually helps me climb up, too, so that's a good thing. We got a little jewel beetle right there. They pop up a lot now that I don't actually need them. But when I did need them, they never popped up, so that's a little upsetting. And the only reason why anyone would need a jewel beetle is just collecting it for the the uh, museum. No. Where's my... I used this one last. I'll keep using this one up so I kind of remember the level of how much I've used it. Onto this tree. Alright, now let's pick up all this debris stuff so we don't have to later. I think it's actually going to fill my inventory now. All these stupid mums just keep growing up here. Uh, let's check that out real quick. Ooh, got f got it for cutting wood. And then I'm going to have to remove that tree. I just noticed that it's going to get in the way as well. Um, I'll possibly make a little pond up here too then. Since I kind of already started making like a little pond. Well, ponds are not connected by river, right? So I don't think I'm going to be making a pond. More, more of a lake. But we'll see. Bam. Bam. Collect this bad boy. We'll collect this bad boy. Alright. And then we have to remove the other flowers as well. Okay. It was my luck to get two freaking beehives right next to each other. I normally don't ever get anything up here, so... Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it was, it was just, uh fate that it would end up being up here since I never do. Okay. Alright. Now let's remove these two and kind of put them at the edge so it's not too bleh. Cool. Now we'll have a double waterfall on this end and kind of like have a little design feature. So let me show you what I was thinking. Bam. 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 And then we'll kind of like Curve off this area. And then... So then we'll have like a little river coming out. Nope, not what I meant to do at all. And the river curving off into this area. And then we'll have like a little pond, lake, or whatever over here. Oop, we'll finish this off real quick. Otherwise, we'll have a, a bunch of trouble doing that. That's not what I want at all. I just want to complete this area off so I can move on to the next step, which is the hedges. 
that's not going to help me destroy that little piece. But I'm thinking that this will just be like a little area for pond fishing, or like river fishing or something. You know, something that I can just get started on. Because I never used this top thing anyway. I was just going to break it down, honestly, but... I won't make too big of a pond. Since it's not that much of a problem. Or that much of a, a want, should I say. Alright, now let's cut off this bad boy. And start one right here. And then we'll put one right here. And then we'll put one right here. And then, it'll curve off this island right here. Bam. And then we'll kind of like, curve it off. Not there. We kind of want it right there, so we'll do it right here. We'll cut off this bad boy. Oh, nope. We'll cut off this bad boy, so we kind of have some area. Let's also do this, and this. That's... I don't know how natural this is actually going to end up looking, but... I'm hoping that it will somewhat look pretty good. <laughs> I don't think it's going to, though. Just the way it already looks. Bam. Now, I kind of want it more rounded up up at the top. So it doesn't look so... Blech. There we go. More rounded up at the top. You got this little river here. And I don't know if I'm going to connect that together. Because it... I don't know if it's going to look good. So we'll keep it like that so far. And let's check our map to kind of see what it looks like now that everything's already changed. Um, so now you can kind of see where I got that. There's like an H at the top. That's going to be like a little bridge. It's going to be awesome looking. I hope. Um, look, there's even a pond over there. So that'll be perfect. I'll be able to connect the river. So let's connect that river real quick. I do not believe that I can make another bridge while I'm funding off another bridge. I don't. I don't believe so. If I can, that'd be awesome. If I can't, oh well. But, let's do this real quick. Um, let, let's break an entrance over here. And then, let's get rid of these. Oh, I guess not. I guess I don't have room. But, let's make like a little waterscaping thing. No, bad. Okay. I gotta move those chairs, but I cannot move the chairs with the stuff that I have in my hand. So, I'm going to have to put these... Ah, they're mums. I'm going to go sell them. I'm going to go sell these ugly mums. There's no reason for me to have them in the first place. They're not an attractive flower. I don't like them. They're my most disliked flower. I like how Bruce just went over there. I wonder if the animals are eventually going to like it. I know that tomorrow they're going to be like, Oh, hey, I just saw you yesterday doing a bunch of crap. I'm going to be like, Yes, sirree, dude. I did a bunch of stuff. Alright, welcome, welcome. Uh, what do you need today? Of course, what exactly are you offering? I'm offering some beehives, mums, and let's see, we got wood, we got weeds, I don't think, well, there's another mum right there, so we'll sell all that stuff off to you. This is the first time that I'm actually having inventory issues. Wow, well, that was actually a lot more, probably because of the beehives, but this is the first time I'm having inventory issues. Usually I have bunch of a bunch of inventory. And I never have to worry about it, but this time it's like, nope, you have none right now. What are you doing? Why are you using so much? Um, once uh, Coach's house is built, I'll work on, like, decorating their little house. But, as for right now, we work on the easy stuff. So let's pick up this. Let's pick up that. And let's kind of get a little river going on over here. Let's kind of curve it a bit. Right here. So then it would like, kind of, bam. Alright, now let's open this one up too. Bam! I think, I think that looks okay. Um, I don't think so actually. I don't like how it looks. Let's try to kind of... No, why would I do that? Um, bam, let's, uh, what to do here? Uh, maybe if we cut, no, no. I mean, this area looks blocked off in the first place. Um, well, maybe when I open that little area up, it'll look better. So maybe I'll kind of leave it how it is. 
for now and kind of see what it looks like. This, this like, whole thing is kind of changing, like, the entirety of this island. But I had plans for the path, okay? So we're going to start off with the path area. So we're going to have... I don't know if I could put bushes on that. So I think it's going to be a one-by-one one path, actually. Bam. We'll put it down one more time. That one more time. And that way we'll kind of have, like, a little nice inverse of, like, one path, two path, three path, and then... Bam. And then we're going to have, like, dirt. Like, wet dirt on the side so we could actually plant those bushes. Um, that way it'll look more realistic because I'm going to have bushes in the middle. The bridge is going to be huge and it's going to kind of like make it look weird, but I don't want anyone kind of falling into the water. That's the point of the bushes. That's what, what their thing is going for. I don't know if I have bushes actually that I could plant. I won't plant them today because I probably do not have them. Let's try right here. Bam. And then one more right here. That way we kind of have like a little step stone. Let me see if I have anything else that would look nice for that. Um, let's try some of the terracotta. Kind of mixing it in. Bam. No, I don't like it. Wooden path? No. Um, uh, maybe we could, we could add the wooden path. Eh, it doesn't look right next to the dirt. Let's keep going with the stone path. Bam. And then the terracotta. That way it kind of looks like little rock things. It looks nice. I think, at least. And then we'll get started with the arc thingy again. Starting off the next route. Bam. We'll go past one. We'll make another one. We'll go past one, make another one. Past again, make another one. Man. Uh, l let me know what you guys think of this, too. And let me know what I... If it's not good, what I could do to change to make it look better. I'm open to suggestions. Who knows if I'll take them, but I'll definitely listen. <laughs> I don't know. This is kind of... Kind of a stretch outside of, like, my comfort zone of designing in the first place. So it might not even look good. It might look terrible to other people. I mean, that little river connection up there at the top to the right doesn't look good. At least I don't think so. But I'm making this so it'll make it easier for when I actually get to Red's Island. Or it'll make it easier to get to Red's Island. <laughs> but other than that, I think I'm going to have to wait for Leaf to actually buy the bushes. I have some prepared, but I kind of want... A good looking white one. I don't have the white one. I have, I think, pink. But that looks nice so far. So, here's here it is. We got Red's Island over there. We're going to try to make it make a good stride. Uh, let's actually fix this area real quick. I don't like how this kind of does this. So, we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll add one right here. And then we'll add one right here. And then one right here. So we got that one. Bam. Curve. Bam. Curve. And bam. We're done with that. Okay. So hear me out here. All right. So we got a little pathway up here to the garden, which I'll eventually fix up. But uh, we want to get to Red's Island, right? So we go straight down this path. Oh my god. And you know what I just noticed? This kind of leads perfectly to it. So whenever his path goes away, or his uh, house goes away, I'll make a path leading directly towards it. Um, we'll go straight through. Bam, bam. We go straight to the middle. You got waterfalls on either side, but you got nice hedges on each side. Um, you can't see it now, but it will. We got a little bridge right in the middle, heading straight towards the back, and bam, there's Red's place. It, it's a full fruit. It's foolproof, okay? Like, yeah, how, how, how do you not get the idea? You, you know what I mean? <laughs> It's an unfinished area, um, because mostly because of Coach's house. It'll be finished eventually. I think that'll be a while before I actually am able to build where Coach's house is. Um, but, 
I, I guess it really doesn't... What do you think about? Huh, Leopold? Uh, whoa, perfect timing. Here, this pull-up bar stand. Wow, now you give me one? Now you give me one. I'm just kidding. It's actually pretty cool. Thank you, Leopold. Okay, now let's put one right here. Put one right here. Bam, now we got... That doesn't look nice. We'll have to put it sideways. And then we'll put one right here. This way I can use up that fencing that I took from Coach's house. Bam. And that way their houses are kind of separated from each other. Bam. Now their houses sort of look the same. Eh, it's fine for now. Alright. Now we got a bunch of crap that I'll probably put at home in my inventory. And there's a balloon that I obviously clearly have to pop. Let's see. Where's my slingshot, though? Um, I do not have a slingshot. Oh, I do. I do have a slingshot. I was about to just give up. Alright, I'm not going to be able to reach it from here. I'm going to have to wait until it gets here. This is going to be a while before this actually reach reaches my plane sight. No, come on. There we go. Alright. And I broke it. <laughs> Perfect timing. So now I definitely don't have a slingshot. Let's check out the present. And it's a bamboo doll. I already know the recipe, so we'll drop that down and we'll wor worry about it later. Let's go put some of this stuff in the inventory so I don't have it all lingering in my hands. Um, I think I'll do a little bit of partial cleanup and then we'll worry about what happens afterwards. I'll have to do a bridge because it's going to get annoying doing that. Like crossing over and over again with a ladder. That's the whole point of all this. Um, let's see, we got a zen fence. We'll worry about that later. We got regular simple wooden fencing. We'll worry about that later. Telescope, doghouse, um, zen cushion. We'll worry about that. Bamboo tree. I can't do anything with the bamboo trees. So I'll have to deal with that eventually. Um, probably, hmm, I'll plant them real quick just so I have them off my in person. And then once I get started on the work for the zen garden... I'll have to redo everything, but it'll look good afterwards. Maybe I'll even replace it for something else. Decisions, decisions. There's been a lot of stuff going on in this episode, though. It'll be great once I'm able to kind of destroy that little tree thing. Um, let's completely remove this fence real quick. We're going to open this up. This whole area up. Like, this all is going to be Zen Garden. <laughs> I think. At least I hope. It's going to be a whole Zen Monastery or whatever. Let's go on top of this mountain real quick. Let's chop these tree just trees down so we have those things. Let's shake them real quick. Each one so we know that we're not missing anything special. Um, ignore that over there. That, that, is, that is none of your business. <laughs> There's not a bunch of fish held captive on the area over there. Okay. Don't call anyone on me. This is this is just this is just island life, you know? This is what my animals ask for. What kind of sea bass I have, though? Every big tank is either sea, sea bass or the big flounder. Sick of sea bass already. But this is great. I already started on my uh, goal of cutting down all of the trees. So, um... Well, wait... A couple more days until we get started on the tree thing. I, I want to kind of get this Zen Garden situated. Situated in terms of like better, betterness. <laughs> Look at that. We even got a nice little fossil. But yeah. This whole top mountain is going bye bye. Okay. There's no need for it. I am absolutely done with it. So let's pull out our, our little thing real quick. And we'll end off the episode with kind of just cutting a little bit of it down. Just one half of it. And I think that'll be it. Well, maybe we'll cut it all down real quick. While you guys are here with me. <laughs> I think it'd be nice to kind of visualize how much space I'm actually going to have for when I actually work on this. Um, Coach's house is going to be moved tomorrow. This whole area is going to look ugly for a while. I'm going to have to deal with that. It's kind of the curse that I, I, I'm going to have to live with. Once it... Once Coach's house is completely gone, though, I'm going to be able to decorate and do whatever I want with that area. So, I will be able to 
make an incline or whatever. Well, I won't be able to make an incline because I have to get rid of the other incline. Until then, though. <laughs> That's not what I wanted at all. Until then, though, I will plan for the Zen Garden stuff. Um, I'll have to, like, draw up some ideas what I'm going to do with the Zen Garden. Otherwise, it's going to look super ugly. I think it's going to end up looking ugly anyway. I had a good plan, and it looked pretty decent. It was tiny, yes. I'm going to have to make a lot of that wall, which was iron and stone, so it's going to be pretty expensive to do. But you guys are here on this journey, so... <laughs> Let me know what you guys want. What we'll want to see? What could make it better? How how to make it easier at least? You know. Otherwise, this is gonna be a pain in in the arse. So far, though, it's been pretty chill on having like all this stuff destroyed and fixed up. It hasn't been too hard destroying everything. In fact, it's only taken about an hour to do all this. A little bit over an hour, not too much over, but. It's pretty good, honestly. I want to know what I'm going to work on next, but I want to focus on this, because if I get an idea on what to work on next, it'll never end. Just like the rec center, I still am working on that to this day. Oh, in fact, that's something that I need to look into. So, look at all that area space that I have now for the Zen Garden. That's all going to be utilized, so don't even worry. Um, one thing that I wanted to show off before we go that I was just talking about is the Zen Garden. Or not the Zen Garden, the Rec Center. The Rec Center has a little bit of upgrades that I wish I would have shown earlier. But, you know, such is life if I didn't. Here we go. The Rec Center has a new room. A new room in it. And I cannot wait to get started on it. I haven't done anything to the Rec Center since last time I showed it off. Which was a few episodes ago. Um, here, look at this bad boy. It looks so nice now. But we got a new room for it, which lines perfectly with my desk and everything, which I was hoping for. Um, this room, which is probably going to be the workout room. And I'm hoping to get mirror on the wall, but I don't think there's a, a wallpaper that's mirrored. But if I get that, that'll be awesome. I'll get some nice, like, cloth flooring or whatever. Maybe even some personal design. But other than that, I think it's pretty clear that this episode's over so thank you guys for watching and joining me do that whole little section over there it was a pain um eventually this area will get a little better we're gonna get a cool like sightseeing area over here we'll put some fence down so you can kind of see the whole top river whatever i don't even know but other than that i think that's it have a really good night guys do not let the bed bugs bite I suppose if you want to see more of uh, waterfall design, we could look into doing that, but have a good morning if it's morning. Peace out.